so much to tell y'all like it's been a lot going on is why i haven't been on here but i'm back and i'm better well not better but you know we're getting through it you know and stuff but if y'all are new to my channel please like comment subscribe turn that post notification bell on because i will continue to be dropping videos back to back for the rest of 2022 you know so yeah stay tuned you know and Let's just get right into it, you know? No need to wait. So y'all, where to begin? I don't know. Um, It's a lot like that happened and like I don't like speaking on it, you know? Because it's like, it's not like something easy to talk about you know and like you you know you know you're young you know we all young like you know so like when you're at the age like 18 and 19 and stuff like that's when stuff really starts to hit you like things are like <clears throat> more different more challenging just a lot more stuff that you have to do that you, you know, wasn't expecting to do and stuff, you know, at that age. But then it's like, that's with anybody. Like, you know, you're growing up, so you have more responsibility and all that stuff to do. But it's also like things that are like, can happen during, during like those times. Like, <clears throat> and it could be bad, it could be good, it could be emotional. Like emotionally drained and physical and stuff so like it's a lot that goes into everything and why it happens you know but that's just how life is you know we can't control life we you know let it be how it is and if we have to go through trials and tribulations and stuff then yep that's what it has has to be but yeah I've been like suffering like depression a little bit like for the past two months so why i really haven't been on here because i've been suffering depression like i've been a lot more emotional lately you know my anxiety goes up you know i have attacks in my sleep nobody really knows about that um besides my friends and my family you know they know what i suffer and what i go through you know so it's just and then, you know, it's also, like, physically stuff that happens to you, you know, stuff. Like, it could be mentally, you know, or emotional, too. But it's just, like, you wouldn't expect that stuff to happen. Like, you think something, like, good comes out of stuff. But then it's, like, it turns into a bad situation. And it could really break a person. It could really hurt a person to the point, like, that you know in their head they're like okay i don't want to do this again i don't want to try this again you know it gives their hopes up you know and stuff and like makes them lose faith and confidence and all that stuff but while like i was suffering through like that stuff um depression and stuff like yes my family was here for me like i wouldn't say they were here for me like mentally like on the level that I was on like I felt like honestly nobody cared really I felt like I was alone like by myself like and I was going through everything by myself you know and stuff and you know it's just like when people's like oh that they're here for you and they'll talk to you and stuff it's like I don't know if I could believe that because it's like 
yeah, even if I do talk to you, you know, about it and stuff, it's like, it's not happening to you at the end of the day at the same time. So it's like, how can you really understand what I'm going through? You know, if you're not, you're not going through it yourself. So it's like, which I know, like nobody is, you know, they can't obviously under really understand what's going on with you, but they could try to, and then try to like help you out in a way. So that's kind of like what some of my friends were doing. Like they were trying to give me like tips and stuff and, you know, like what I could do to try to better myself or to grow, you know, and stuff like, which I do really appreciate those friends that were there for me and they know who I'm talking about. Um, but I don't know. I just, this is a point of time, like where I just shut down and I don't want to talk to nobody. I don't want to, don't want to eat. I want to sleep. I just want to cry. Like, and it's just, and it's okay to cry. Like, you know, sometimes we need to cry because sometimes we can build and hold too, too much in and stuff. And it becomes a lot of weight on our shoulders and stuff. Like, we like literally are like, everything would become heavy. Like, it'll feel like, it'll feel like 10 times more. Like, just pressure and, and heaviness on you. Like, and like, I have not like gone through anything like this before. So it's like, it's, it hit harder. Like, you know, the first time it, you go through something like that, it hits harder. And I think I'm probably like, what the heck is you talking about? So, <laughs> <clears throat> what I'm talking about is, I was recently in a relationship. Um, but also, like, it wasn't just the relationship. It was also stuff going on with my parents and like stuff like that was happening at home so but i'm not gonna get into the stuff that's happening at home because it's nobody business and like it's just stirs up more mess you know and i don't want that and but just know like <clears throat> i was dealing with stuff here too and that's also caused on to the stress and the anxiety and the depression and all that stuff My throat is like really raspy today. I think it's because like the weather has literally been raining and just been cold and it's allergy season, you know. <clears throat> but yeah, so I was recently in a relationship and you know, I'm thinking, you know, everything is going good, you know, and stuff. But then there was a lot of stuff that wasn't good about it you know it's both like we didn't have communication like that you know it was more so of like he didn't have stuff going on for himself but i did you know i, I ran a tight sh you know schedule tight shift but i always try to make time you know and stuff but with him it's like he didn't have none of that and he didn't try to make time even though he had like all this time you know and it was just draining kind of because it's like I'm doing all the work like what are you doing like you say that you care about me and all this stuff but you really if your actions speak louder than words like you could say anything that you want all day like but are you gonna show it like are your actions gonna show that you actually mean what you say like because everything that he was saying it was like not adding up to his actions like at all i didn't think we would break up but we did and he broke up with me really i didn't break up with him first like it was a mutual decision but he caught it first and it just kind of like my head like what's the reason why you breaking up because what did i do in the relationship that was that was bad like you know stuff like because like, he had no reason you know to break up you know with me but i had multiple reasons to break up with him like at first like when i was thinking about it i was like i was kind of mad because like i wanted to be the first one to do it like and, yeah that's rude of me to say but like if y'all knew what i went through in the relationship y'all would have been like oh yeah girl you should have been left like why you stayed 
And I don't know. I don't know why I stayed. It was, I guess, my head, like, I was falling in love with this person and I wanted to be with this person. So it was just like, I was going to do it, whatever to keep it. But that's really what's been going on, y'all. Like, you know, a lot been going on at home. I've just been suffering depression a little bit. You know, my anxiety attacks, you know, stuff, school. And then the whole relationship thing that happened with him. Like, that's, it's like everything that leading up to now. Like, but yeah. But I thank y'all for listening, y'all. This is just like a little... You know, telling y'all what why I was gone, you know, and stuff. Why I was, hadn't really been posting videos. But I'm going to start posting videos now, you know, and stuff. I'm going to try to do some pranks for y'all because, like, I've been wanting to do pranks for the longest. But I've been trying to wait till I get my camera because, you know, I'm trying to do pranks, you know, and stuff. But, honestly, like, I don't know if I'm going to start doing them yet because I do want my camera first. But if I do get my camera beforehand like i'm gonna start doing it or i'll just probably start doing it on my phone if i like could figure out how to do that but yeah i'm gonna start posting more now like you know stuff i got some vlogs you know and stuff and then christmas december coming up so i'm probably gonna do vlogmas i don't know yet like but yeah we're gonna do vlogmas probably you know so i could keep content rolling and like for y'all and stuff but you know I appreciate y'all for watching my video, you know, I love y'all guys, you know, make sure y'all stay tuned, you know, comment, subscribe, like, turn on the post notification bell, because I'm just gonna be dropping videos, you know, hopefully back to back, if not back to back, at least every other, like, every week sometime, you know, and stuff, but like, yeah, but I'm gonna see y'all guys, thank y'all. You know, I love y'all. Stay tuned. We are out.